Good morning, Power of 30 friends. Today is Friendship Friday, and Friendship Friday is all about sharing our favorite things about food with our friends. So today I wanted to share with you some of my favorite cookbooks and resources. So these are the cookbooks that are on my counter all the time. I never tuck them away um, because they, they've got sticky pages. That's how I know that they're favorites is when my cookbooks have sticky pages. So the one I'm gonna share with you is probably the one that started it all that got me on this mission to be a culinary nutrition expert and that is the book Undiet by Megan Telpner. Now this book is less of a cookbook though it does have recipes in it and it's more of a guide on how to live a healthy and vibrant life. So it's called Undiet Eat Your Way to Vibrant Health and the reason it's called Undiet is because the whole um, philosophy and approach in this book is to undo all the ideas and concepts we have with dieting. It's about just eating whole foods um, and you know labels are for tin cans is what Megan likes to say. I've had the pleasure of meeting Megan in person and she is just lovely and she is also the founder and um, lead teacher of the program that I just took. So this is a really great book to read. It's, it's, it's a book, it's got recipes, it's got tips for life, and it really um, is a big version of what I'm trying to accomplish in 30 days with the power of 30. It's got a lot of similar approaches and philosophies, so that is a really, really great book. And Megan's latest book, which she just came out with, is the Undiet Cookbook. So this cookbook is actually, um, takes all the philosophies and principles from the Undiet book and it's got the recipes in here. So there are 130 gluten-free recipes for a healthy and awesome life. So her recipes are gluten-free, they are vegan and dairy-free. And the reason is, is because those um, are the wheat, dairy, and, and well, and meat, meat. Um, that's another whole story, but especially with, with um, wheat and dairy and sugar are the major culprits for inflammation and disease in the body. And Megan herself has a great story that she shares in the End Diet book about how she cured herself from an autoimmune disease at the age of 26 just through nutrition. And so this book is great. It's got a ton of awesome recipes in it. Um, I shared with you uh, the link to Megan's blog as well where she also has her blog post. She's got recipes on there and there's more information about the Academy of Culinary Nutrition as well. So these two books by Megan Telpner, awesome. I would definitely highly recommend them. Another one that I really enjoy is from another Canadian author. Her name is Marilyn Smith, and I've got a lot of tabs on this cookbook, and it's got many sticky pages. I like to think of myself as like a mini Marilyn Smith. Again, I've had the pleasure of meeting Marilyn, and she is lovely. She's often on uh, Canada's number one daytime talk show, um, City Line. She's also on breakfast television quite a quite often. She is a former teacher, so she has a special place in my heart. Uh, and she taught home ec, so she's a professional home economist. Uh, and she's also had um, been in, on Second City. So she's she, she talks about uh, that her recipes and health advice are seasoned with laughter. So the way that she, again, this is not just a cookbook, it's an, you can actually read this cookbook. Um, so it's got recipes, it's got health tips, and information about the nutritional benefits of ingredients throughout her book. Um, her recipes are divided seasonally, as well as they're categorized um, as family friendly uh, or child friendly. And um, she categorizes the food based on their um, main ingredients, their main properties. So she's got a section for cruciferous vegetables, which are broccoli and cauliflower and kale. Um, she's got a sex section on beans, beans, musical fruit. She's got things on, um, on uh, mushrooms and uh, greens and more of the sweet starchy vegetables. Uh, like squashes. Uh, so this is a really great book, family friendly. It's all from scratch um, and she she's meat as well as she does include dairy. So if you are gluten free, um, you know, maybe proceed with caution with this book. You'll have to make some adjustments, but uh, it's a great resource. I also love the beginning of her book where she talks about um, the kinds of things that you need in the kitchen and has some really great culinary tips. And 
there's me and Marilyn. I did a little stint for City Line where I met Marilyn and then she invited me to the Home Economist convention. That was pretty cool too. Another book that I really enjoy is called Joyous Health by Joy McCarthy. Again, this book is divided into, it's half a recipe book and half a general health book. So really great, just like the Undiet book, for familiarizing yourself with tips and strategies. You'll find there's a lot of overlap between the Joyous Health book as well as the Undiet book, um, but it's got some fabulous recipes as well. Um, she doesn't, she's, she's a meat eater. She does do some dairy and some gluten, though not high on it. And um, she also talks a lot about superfoods. Um, and just like the Undiet Cookbook, they also give some meal plans. So Joyous Health, another Canadian superstar. And I think she's on shows like the Stephen and Chris and maybe the Marilyn Dennis show as well. So another great one, great blog, great website for Joyous Health as well. That's Joy McCarthy. The last book I wanted to share with you is one that a lot of people are familiar with. It started out as a blog and it grew into something just super. So Angela Leiden had, um, she struggled with, um, with eating, um, and I, I can relate to that as a teenager as well, um, where food was really her enemy for a really long time. And it wasn't until she embraced being a vegan where she began to appreciate her body and as well as the food that she used to nourish it. So the Oh She Glows cookbook is sister to the Oh She Glows website, which also has um, a blog and recipes on there as well. Now this is a vegan book, um, but certainly a lot of things you can adapt to eat with meat if you are so inclined. Um, but you, if you are a vegan or vegetarian, this is a great book and one that certainly can fit your lifestyle wholeheartedly. So just to recap, some of my favorite books to share with my friends for the power of 30 are the Oh She Glows cookbook and check out the blog, Joyous Health, Healthy Starts Here with Marilyn Smith, The Undiet, and The Undiet Cookbook by Megan Telpner. So I'd love for you to share with us on Facebook or send me an email and I'll share it with the group. What are your favorite cookbooks and which of your cookbooks have sticky pages? From my kitchen ears, let's make meals that matter. Bye.